let's take a look at problem 15a you can download this and all of my problems in the workbook it's just linked below or go to tonybell.com you'll find a pdf file no signups none of that stuff let's jump into the problem consider the following personal tax brackets uh and there's a bunch of tax brackets it says assume a person governed by these tax brackets earns one hundred seventy-five thousand dollars this year how much tax do they owe okay the rookie mistake is you find 175 on the table you'd say oh it's somewhere on this line of the tax bracket we would earn 175k therefore 175 times 45 percent that's how much i owe in taxes that's not how tax brackets work for our first fifty thousand dollars we earn we pay 20 percent for our next 50 uh 28 for our next 50 37 and so only 25,000 of our 175 the last 25 is taxed at 45 percent so it's 50k at 20 percent it's 50k at 28 percent it's 50k at 37 percent and then it's just you know to get to 175 it's our last 25k at 45 percent so let's do some math 50 times 20 percent that's ten thousand dollars 50 times 28 percent fourteen thousand dollars i did it quick in my head there i should have trusted myself 50 times 37 percent eighteen thousand five hundred dollars and last but not least 25,000 times 45 percent is 11,250 okay so then our total tax bill here is going to be 10,000 plus 14,000 plus 18,500 plus 11,250 our total tax bill is 53 seven five zero but oh we've answered it question one how much tax do they owe fifty three seven fifty what's their average tax rate well you take that fifty three grand and you divide by how much we earned 175 grand so take 53 divided by 175 and on average it's 30.7 percent what is our marginal tax rate our marginal tax rate is the tax rate on the next dollar we earn so if let's just say we got a consulting contract and we were able to make ten thousand more dollars right some extra contract so we weren't going to make 175 we were, we were going to make 185 what's the taxes on that new ten thousand dollars we make the tax rate is 45 percent. that's sort of where we're sitting on the tax scale so uh the marginal tax rate is any new money that comes in what's the tax rate going to be on that 45 percent which rate the average or the marginal should we use when doing project analysis in corporate finance the answer here is marginal i'll just blurt out the answer let me explain why when we're looking at new projects we're looking at typically additional projects so it's like that new consulting gig if i bring in ten thousand extra dollars what am i taxed at the number 30.7 percent doesn't mean anything to the new project all new dollars that this company brings in are going to be taxed at 45 percent. so that's the number you use in project analysis that's the most appropriate number to use and there'd be one more thing that's appropriate to use i hope you use one of those buttons as you uh click away from this video all right thanks for watching see you in the next video bye bye